What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. My name is Morgan Johnson. Thank you so much for coming and checking my channel. I greatly appreciate it. I have one that I'm super excited for today. It is all candy related. I love candy. I found some things that I've never tried before. I don't even know how I found them if we're being honest. I was in the store and I saw them and I said, I have never heard of this before and I don't think anyone else has either. Let me know in the comments below if you've tried this or if you've seen this in your local stores. But yeah, let's jump right in. First up, we have the Orange Cream Pop Twizzlers. They're a limited edition summer candy, um, and they just, they look really good. So we have, oh, they're very sticky though. Oh. Okay, so you have the cream in the center. It is orange. Let's give this thing a shot. more of an orange soda -y flavor like the cream in the middle doesn't have too much flavor to it but the Twizzler itself is really good I would definitely buy these again I definitely like them I'm gonna rate it 7 out of 10 next up we have Kool-Aid gummies you heard that right Kool-Aid made their own gummies I love Kool-Aid I drank it all the time as a kid in the summer so I feel like this should have a lot of nostalgia for me but I really hope that they're not just like any other gummy. You know, like gummies kind of taste the same to me, so I'm really hoping that they're good. I'm gonna start, oh, they're really sticky. I don't like that. I'm gonna start with the red one, because red in anything is amazing. Let's see. Oh. Okay, red, red wasn't it. Let's try this blue green flavor. Oh, wow. They're like. They just taste like a normal gummy, but with like worse consistency. Like it's kind of a harder gummy, if that makes sense. It's really chewy, it's really sticky. They taste stale. Like I feel like that's the best way to describe them. The, these are a no-go for me. They're really disappointing. I thought they were going to taste just like Kool-Aid. Get some nostalgia going. Definitely did not do that. These get a 3 out of 10. Now, I said that I would drink Kool-Aid a lot as a kid in the summertime, but I also drank a lot of Hawaiian Punch. When I saw these things, I got super stoked on them. They're essentially Airheads, but Hawaiian Punch flavored. And I these things caught my attention. These are what kind of pointed out the rest of the strange candy in the aisle for me. So I'm super stoked on trying this one. Let's see. Oh. Oh, I did it. Great. All right, like I said with the Kool-Aid, red is generally a universally good flavor. So we're gonna start with that. Um, I do love Airheads. So I'm really hoping that these have at least enough flavor to compare with an Airheads. Let's see. Oh my God. I think I just broke my teeth. Are these, are they old? Oh my God. They're not old. Thanks for 2022. Okay. I'm going to get, I'm gonna open in this one. And I'm gonna get really close to the camera. I want y'all I want y'all to hear this up close and personal okay it like it, it just broke off they are the flavor sucks the consistency definitely sucks these get a negative 18,000 out of 10 okay trash the last two have really really disappointed me uh, and I'm really hoping that this one can at least redeem something for this video we have Jolly Rancher gummies. Now, like I said with the Kool-Aid ones, most gummies taste the same, and I hate that, because I love gummies, uh, and the ones that have like really good flavor, good and great, but the ones that suck, like the Kool-Aid ones, it just kind of ruins gummies for me. So let's see if Jolly Ranchers can redeem them. They kind of, they kind of, they kind of feel kind of hard. Nothing's expired, by the way. Like this is in 2022, all the candies in 2022. 
I'm gonna try blue and pink. Mm. Blue raspberry and watermelon. Oh, these are spot on. I was a little worried with that consistency because it, it feels hard in my hand, uh, but as soon as it hit my mouth, it got more like soft and kind of melted in there as soon as I started chewing. Oh, these are good. Let's try the strawberry and lemon. Mm -hmm. These are exactly what I wanted them to be. They taste just like Jolly Ranchers, just in a gummy form. Like it's the same good, strong taste. And then it's just, I think it's a better consistency. Like I don't want to break my teeth on a Jolly Rancher. I would eat the Hawaiian Airheads if I wanted to do that. These are really, really good. I'm going to give it to them. 10 out of 10. These are exactly what they should be. Next up, we have the Starburst Duos. This sounds like a great idea. Uh, we have blue raspberry lemonade and strawberry watermelon. Um, let's see which first one we pick. Okay, blue raspberry lemonade. I want to show you the packaging compared to what the candy itself actually looks like. So I'm really curious if it's going to be like half yellow, half blue. And it is. There's that. Alright, let's try this. What the heck? Oh! Have strawberries always been this hard? Is it because they're like mixing flavors? I don't know what the deal with this is. Like it gets softer as I start to chew it, but the first experience is not good. If you're a dentist watching this, I'm so sorry, by the way. My poor teeth, I know. It's down. Honestly, the flavor wasn't even good either. It was way too lemony. Like I got zero blue raspberry and it just tasted more like sour. Texture's bad, taste is bad. I don't know what these companies are doing or where they're getting their candy from right now, but not good. I'm gonna rate that one, I would say like a three out of 10. Last but not least, we have Warhead Cubes. These are a sour and sweet, fruity, chewy candy. Now with everything else that's been chewy today, I just hope the, these are different. I hope that these are soft and they're good. We gotta end out on a bang, cause that was not it with Starburst. Oh, I like these. Okay, here's a blue, the little cubes. This looks like the uh, the ice gum, like the, the cube ice gum or whatever. That's what I thought about when I first saw this. Let's see. I'm kind of confused. Mmm. Okay. So I tried the blue raspberry, the strawberry, and the watermelon. The watermelon is really the only one that had a flavor to it. The other two kind of tasted extremely similar. They're not overly sour. They're definitely more sweet. Um, but that's kind of how I think all sour candy is, like, in the commercial world. It can't be too sour because it's marketed for kids. And obviously if it's too sour for the kids, they're not going to buy it anymore. So definitely more sweet than sour. The watermelon one was really good. That had a really good flavor to it. The blue raspberry and the strawberry, kind of a letdown. I am going to try the green apple because I feel like that's going to have a lot of flavor to it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that has a good flavor to it. I didn't try the orange or the black cherry. I think that the black cherry will probably have flavor. The orange probably won't. But overall, they're a good consistency in my mouth. I like them. They're nice and soft. They're not like overly chewy. I was kind of worried about that. But you chew it a couple times, it melts right into your mouth. I really liked them. That was a good eating experience. I'm going to rate those 7 out of 10. And just like that, guys, we are done with all the candy. I hope this helps you in your next candy purchase. Some of those were a very, very, very major letdown. Some of them were really good. Um, I'm going to probably throw away all of those hard ones because my teeth just can't handle it. I might even go back to the store and say like, did something happen? Because I don't want to judge these candies if it was the store's fault, like storing them wrong. But those were awful. Like they were so hard on my teeth. Bad experience. I would never buy them again due to that. So take with that what you will. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you smash that thumbs up button, hit the subscribe button, ring the bell so you get all my post notifications, and I will see y'all in the next one. Peace.